there! I'm Chris Rachel Loseland of Kitchen Overlord, back with another Geeky Kitchen Gadget Review. Today, I've got two minutes to tell you everything you need to know about the Sonic Screwdriver Peeler before the War Unicorn Apocalypse! Oh, that's gonna be adorable! And I already have a carrot to feed them! <laughs> Alright, I gotta admit, I was pretty excited when I saw the peeler because that's actually a great idea if you physically look at it compared to a sonic screwdriver. It's a good form factor, it actually makes sense when you look at them together, and it's not another damn TARDIS. I really approve of them making things that are not just another blue rectangle. Go you guys! Now you need to make them really usable, or just a little bit usable, like it doesn't have to be the best thing in the universe. So let's see how the sucker actually holds up. Um, it's a peeler. And at this point, I have... Oh, I got a carrot tread. Let's see, let's try some more. Um, I'm trying every different angle on this carrot to get some shreds off of it. Uh, let's... Oh, okay, three little shreds. All right. In case you think I just really suck at peeling things, I have my $4.99 Target uh, Y-shaped peeler. Let's give it a little bit of comparison here. Um, yeah, literally barely touching it at all with that. Like, I'm just using some fingertips here and things are coming off. If I was actually applying the tiniest bit of energy or precision or really trying to do anything other than make a mess just to prove how easy it is to get things off with my $5 peeler, um, it would be pretty impressive and I wouldn't have carrot shreds all over the place. I would have nice neats for rows of them. Let's try again. Let's see if maybe peeling this in advance makes it a little easier to use the, the targeted peeler. Okay. <laughs> this is getting ridiculous. Okay, I got a tiny chunk on my face. I got a chunk out. And god damn it, I I really wanted this one to work. This is one that I just, from the look of it, I just approve. I wanted it. I'm sorry. I really am. I went into this really hoping that this was going to be one of my favorite reviews because sometimes the kitchen gadgets are fantastic. But it's, oh, according to my timer here, I've only got a couple seconds left. So I'm going to go feed this carrot to the war unicorns and hope that they can mop up my sad crocodile tears over the ineffectiveness of this. I, I'm sorry. I want it to work. Why won't you work? Oh man. Oh, oh man. This, this is a mess. Why won't you work? Are you too good for that? Five bucks. 